Hello guys, Paul and I am in the new apartment. We've been busy right now. We are installing the dishwasher that we bought, which we didn't think worked, but we found out the deep reason it didn't get out of the water is because one of these little things sits in there. We found out with the other one, but we didn't bother putting this up, which is good. Um, just about to fit this in and see how we can like mount it so it fits perfectly in here. And then um, the old door, gonna be unscrewed the hinges and stuff. And we're gonna be like kind of first sticking it on there and see if it like sits where it's supposed to. Um, so yeah, but that looks already a lot better than the other one. The whole plan is to hide it so we don't see it. And then when we use it, that's it. So yeah, um, I think that's gonna be the main project of the day. Then I'm probably gonna start um, moving some stuff along from the basement. Uh, it's very, very warm today, so we don't know how much we're gonna do. Uh, we opened the balcony here, but it's so warm out there, the Sally is not even there. She's out in the staircase out here in front because it's nice and cool. Where is that little minx anyway? Hello, are you cooling down? It's nice out here, isn't it? <laughs> so yeah, um, I'm just heading over to the apartment and trying to see if I can find some double-sided sticky tape I have and just put a couple of strips on there and try and like place the door and see if the door will open and not scratch onto that one there because if that does that I'll have to cut a little bit of that um, height wise so we'll have to see so Paul is just putting a draw in and can you show me what's in that cupboard there I'd like to see what's in that cupboard oh a dishwasher now that was clever so uh, we fixed it guys now all we need to do is connect it it's like people say oh, instead of doing all that we haven't connected it but um, you can see it works now. A little help with the thumb there. Pull it and opens, and when we close it, just a little click there. But I think we've done well. Um, unfortunately, the bottom is to swing too much around that there has to be leaning, but if you stand back, you don't see it really. It's mainly invisible. And I'll see the cupboard tomorrow, I'll just show you the top off. Yeah, just a tiny little bit off. Um, so now all we need to do is connect and everything. We have already put all the uh, uh, hoses and wiring in here, so all we need is just to slam it all in, put a dishwasher tablet in and test it out. Um, but I'm sure it should work fine. But it looks nice. Um, it's really nice, secure and everything. It doesn't move anywhere. And it's stealth. I wish they would have done the same with the fridges here. That would have been good. If they'd done the whole thing around so everything was stealth, hidden. Uh, unfortunately, the fridge have to be inside a cupboard to do it. And these doors here are really, really big. It's a large fridge. So, um, but brand new fridge again, which is nice. But the oven is different here. Something Paul knows in the oven, which we like. Like, if you like this, ooh, nice brand new oven. Okay, let's close it. And you do like that, up to there. Well, how much is it? There we go. Still close. And Paul looked up this oven. How much was it? About 18,000? 18, 19,000 for these ovens. 2,000 pounds. I don't know how much those in dollars, but uh, it's a lot. So it's not cheap stuff here, but they are they are signed up these here with the lift. It's called luxury apartments, and they basically are. They're really big. Uh, when you're standing in living room and kitchen, think that's a small living room kitchen in one, but that's not where the size is. The size is the big hallways and the very large bedrooms. So uh, yeah. Alrighty, but that's one project down. So we meant to do that and let's just connect it and uh, see if we can get it going. I just wanted to show you guys. So the dishwasher is all connected and it's actually running right now. Uh, it's nice and quiet. Uh, we connected everything underneath and it looks nice and tidy if you look in here. So yeah. And it's going perfectly. So we thought we might have bought a broken washing machine or dishwasher but that was just a, a block in the pipe. So it works. So now we have another dishwasher that we don't really need. Um, we're probably gonna sell that. Nice sunny day, it's really warm. But now we can see we're definitely gonna need blind here because people are walking by looking straight into us. And uh, we will need some somewhat privacy. So we're gonna have some blinds hanging down to here and then see if we can get one there as well. So yeah. Stand up, stand up. Come on. Come on. Stand up. up, stop messing about. It's 
she's molting. Just getting ready to take Sally out for a walk. It's late at night. Uh, it's like 11 or something like that. But that's why we put lights on Sally. I need to take this down the bin. So let's do that. Come on, Sally. Take the stairs. <laughs> she's got lights on. <laughs> now we can see her. All right, but I'm taking my bicycle because we're going on a little and a good run, so that's gonna be nice. <laughs> so guys, I'm on my bike. You can see my light there, and Sally's come flying there. <laughs> uh, I can't see you much. I need to have a bit of light. I have front light on, but they'll only so like they can see where you are in traffic. You can't use them for anything at all. I've got to bring my own flashlight. So I'm driving basically in blind now. <laughs> so uh, hopefully you don't crash. We'll see when I come back. I'll catch you guys shortly. Oh, someone having a little pit stop there, Sally. I'll see you guys when I come back home, but this is a bit scary holding the camera, and the camera got a little bit of light on the screen, so it's kind of blinding me, so I still can't see anything. Here he goes. <laughs> I'm back from a little walk, and uh, yes, it was a little bit scary riding around the dark, not having a proper front light, so I'm going to go and see if I can find a light for my bicycle now. Um, you can get those like very very strong lights and then where you have a battery pack for it I want to look up one of those uh, and see how how much they are and what I can get uh, I'm not gonna buy a brand one because they're gonna cost so much more So I'm just gonna get like a, a cheaper version, but still works. So yeah um, As I told you guys yesterday in my video that I'm not uh, or the other day that I'm not very motivated um, Watching Anna's Dal vlog she said like try and set some plans for every single day i never been good at that, but I want to try and do that. So tomorrow my plan is that I want to empty the basement here and get everything over in the new basement, sort everything out um, so we know what to keep and what not to keep. Because there's a lot of stuff down there we don't want to keep anymore. Then I also want to like sort apart what I want to sell. Um, as I mentioned, I want to sell some of my RC cars, the big ones, which I don't really ride, and try and save up money for um, a nice um, drone. Uh, I'm not going to buy um, one of those DJIs because it's a lot of money for what you get. You can build something similar or equivalent um, for cheaper money yourself. Uh, and I already got the remote, which is also an expensive part, so I don't need that. Um, so that's my thought. I would really like to go in FPV having those glasses and have a big drone to fly around and film and have fun with. And then get a small race court to uh, fly around. Uh, that would be so much fun. So yeah. So that's my goal tomorrow, um, sold out the basement. Uh, today we did the goal of putting in a dishwasher. Small goal, didn't take long, but we did it and it's done. And it's nice and ready for us to move in. Paul has been all checked and everything is sealed and tight and there's no leak, so that's perfect. But anyways, I want to see you tomorrow and hopefully a lot more eventful day where we go sort out stuff. I'm going to show you a whole lot of things we got down the basement. And if there's something which I think we could use for giveaways, I'll put it aside and we can use it for giveaways. There might be some stuff. But I'm going to catch you tomorrow. Take care guys. Peace.